Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Reverse Engineered. In today's episode, we are going to start to work on the passenger side apron. Then we will start to grind down all those rolls that we did in the other episode. And after that, we will start the paint prep process. Now we still have to pull that apron towards me. Once we get that done, we're going to be completely done with the entire front end of the car and we can start assembling the fender's hood bumper. Okay, and so right now we are checking for symmetry on the aprons. Go at it, boys. Good. Good on that side. And on the driver's side. Perfect. Couldn't be better. We have just finished pulling onto this apron here. We pulled it into its original position. And uh, right now we still have to remove this bracket here as it's bent. And uh, we have to cut out six spot welds once we get that done we can remove this bracket straighten it out and uh, weld it back into its original position Now that the bracket is out, it took a little while to drill all the spot welds. The metal is pretty thick. You can see it's a little bent. I don't know if the camera can catch that. Now, now we have to continue pulling on the frame, the apron, to get some creases out on the sides, weld on some spots, and then weld this bracket back on after we strain it out. Here's a close up view of how the apron looks right now. It's bent here on this side. It overlapped and so we have to pull it out from here, get it straight here on the bottom and also get it straight here on the top. Once we get that done, we can weld back the bracket.
Finally finished installing all the parts on the car. The gaps look okay. Keep in mind this is just a rough fitment. But we still need some minor bodywork on, on the car like this one here. As you can see it's a little bit bent the door and on the other side as well. That over there. But what we wanted to check for is the gaps. And all the fine tuning will be done later. Since we're done with the fit man, we'll take all the parts off and get going with grinding. Now I finished grinding down all the welds. Now it's time to prep it for paint, bondo, any sealer we're gonna put on.
finish the bond work. Right now we're waiting for it to dry up. Then we're gonna start sanding it, and then priming it, and after that we're gonna paint. This is the kind of primer used for priming the car. It's a two-in-one primer, which means it's a sealer and a primer at the same time. Here's a quick tip, whenever you're done spraying, turn the spray can upside down and spray so you can clear the tip. Right now I'm spraying some Bulldog Adhesion Promoter so paint will stick to plastic. Since there's too many angles on the front of the car, I'll be using the little one instead of this one, the Tecna Pro Light.
we have reached the end of this episode thank you everyone for watching make sure you like share subscribe and leave a comment down below and also follow us on instagram at reverse engineered one